Hi, my name is Matt Kasparovich, Product Manager at SOR. Today we are going to be talking about the A15LT Submersible Level Transmitter. The A15LT is a, a continuation of the 800 series pressure transmitter family. The 815LT submersible level transmitter is actually just a pressure transmitter. The way it works is it just measures the hydrostatic pressure at the bottom of a tank. So the point at which the level transmitter is at the bottom of the tank, that is the max height of the liquid level that you can measure. It's very similar to when you're in a swimming pool. When you dive deeper down into the swimming pool, the more pressure you experience on your ears. Uh, that's the same thing that's happening here um, is we're just measuring that amount of pressure that is at that um, that is above that pressure transmitter so we are going to do a live demonstration of how the submersible level transmitter works simply take the level transmitter and drop it into the tank once it hits the bottom of the tank it is fully submerged the cable gland seal on the top of the transmitter here is also acting as a strain relief so, the transmitter can be supported by the strain relief all by itself. Now, the signal input and output are coming here to our remote indicating display. The remote display is showing the liquid level of the transmitter in inches of water column. And so, the transmitter and display are acting as a junction box to have the power supply come in here as well. We are using a 24 volt power supply for this unit. So if we change the level of 35 inches of water column down to 25 inches of water column, you will see the level output change on the display as well. So now the level is at 25 inches of water column. And so if you come back here and check the remote display, you'll see that the display is showing 25 inches of water column. The reason that this remote display is very useful is say you have a sump or a tank that is either down in the ground or high up, this display can be mounted anywhere for convenience. Thus, we can do custom cable links to any length you require to put this display anywhere where it needs to be. The A15LT is actually the same transmitter as the A15PT, except it is now submersible and therefore it has all the same great features and benefits as the A15PT does. This includes features and benefits such as heart communication protocol, Modbus RS-485 serial communications, 1 to 5 volt DC output, as well as a 4 to 20 milliamp output as well. You get all these features whether you ask for it or not. The 815LT comes with 8 separate wires. How you wire it actually determines how you use it. So if you want to use a 4 to 20 milliamp output signal as well as a heart output, it is just a matter of which wires you choose to use at the time. Also built into the A15LT is a switch output. So the switch output actually gives you a built-in switch to either control the level or monitor the level by sending an alarm if the level gets too high or too low. We also have a PVC vent tube in the middle of the cable. This gives you a solid reference to atmospheric pressure at all times. And so when you are taking a level measurement of a tank that is vented to atmosphere, atmospheric pressure changes and therefore you need to have a constant reference to continue to have an accurate, reliable level measurement. There are three main types of process connections for the A15LT. For our standard process connection, we have our standard PVC nose cone option that is actually removable. Underneath the nose cone, we have a half inch MPT male connection as well as a quarter inch female MPT connection for connection to mounting it directly to a pipeline. This is useful for measuring a pipeline that is continuously submerged to be able to monitor the pressure accurately. The PVC nose cone is actually self flushing as well. You have the two holes here that are at different heights that give you a self-flushing feature which is continuously flowing and keeps liquid from building up inside the pressure port. The third option we have is a cage diaphragm seal option. The cage diaphragm seal option incorporates a 2.5 inch flush face diaphragm seal. This is good for applications that contain sludges or slurries that can potentially build up on the inside of the process connection. This way you can easily clean the face of the surface without any issues. It also incorporates the cage assembly to protect it from any 
thing that could potentially damage the face of the sensor while, in it, while it is in service. The cage assembly is easily removable via the nuts here, so you can take it off and clean the face of the diaphragm seal. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video demonstration of the brand new 815LT submersible level transmitter. Please make sure to subscribe to the SOR YouTube channel for more content just like this.